Okay, so first, we're gonna hide our choking arm, which is always the one over the shoulder. Okay, if I just lock up a gable grip, he's gonna attack my choking arm, and I have to readjust and climb around and fight grips. So when I come over, I'm gonna put my underhook arm over my choking arm, so that when he grabs for the peel, he peels the wrong arm, and I can just grab up to the shoulder. It's important that you put your hand not under the armpit, because when you go to chop, you're gonna catch an armpit, okay? When we come over, I'm gonna hide my hand low and at a long angle so that I'm gonna pass the shoulder as opposed to getting caught in it, okay? So I'm basically putting my hand in his opposite pocket, okay? I hide it, he strips the grip, and I chop up, grabbing behind the shoulder, okay? As you can see, my elbow is off. I need to get my elbow in line with his chin. So when he realizes he's on the wrong arm, he's gonna go defend this one. My underhook hand will push his shoulder forward and I'll re-grip, making my arm deeper as much as possible. Because he's pulling here. So I'm gonna push my elbow instead of my hand. Okay? I'm using the, the tricep bicep area of my arm as opposed to my forearm. My forearm's anchored. When I push the shoulder forward, I push my elbow, which is in turn gonna keep everything in place. Now, I want the kind of depth on this where I can grab my own tricep. Okay, I'm not actually gonna grab my own tricep, but I want that kind of reach, okay? So I push forward, re-grip. Now, my underhook hand is gonna go on the back of my choking arm hand. So I'm grabbing, as my hand comes in, point my fingers out, so that as I thread my hand behind his head, I can grab my bicep, okay? My threaded hand, some people like to push with the palm, some people like to push with the back, I push with the pinky, okay? I thread it through. I'm gonna flex my bicep and forearm, pull my choking elbow back, and pinch my shoulder blades together. If you do one thing, it might work. You do all three and you're gonna get it, okay? So flex, pull, squeeze, all right? The big movement is in your back. You're doing like a lat pull, a seated row, okay? That's gonna pull your shoulders back and make your chest go forward. Focus on the pull more so than the push, okay? So we go through, hide the arm, chop up to the shoulder. Push forward, get a deeper grip, palm to the back of the hand, and thread behind their head. I grab my shoulder, bicep, depending how deep I can get. My face is over my lockup. If I'm over here, it's gonna be all awkward. Here, chin down, flex the bicep and forearm, pull the elbow back, pull with your lats, okay?